Hey everyone, it's Nahar Geva here, the CEO and founder of Zik Analytics. Welcome to all the people who are joining this session, to all the Zikers, all the dropshippers, and all the people that are here for the first time. In today's session, it's, we're going to focus on the last video I released to the channel, which focused on how you scale your winning products, how to uh, triple or even make a 10x 10x on your profit using a unique method which called scaling your winning products uh, which uh, we will use uh, for scaling your winning products we will use the similar product method slowly slowly people are joining here and um, thank you very very much for joining uh, this session as I say it's going to be an answer uh, questions and answers about the topic on how to scale your winning products how to make a 10x on your profit when you drop ship or even when you sell on eBay, not just drop shipping. I'll try to demonstrate you. We'll go through the video. We'll do some search, share screen and examples. Please, if you write me, if you see me well, if you hear me well, write in the chat right now that you see me well, that you hear me well, that everything is all right. I see slowly, slowly people are joining here. Thank you very, very much. And we're just going to get everything up and rolling. Make sure to comment right now in the chat if you see me well and you write me well. Make sure to ring the notification bell to be uh, uh, notified on the next session. I see slowly, slowly people are joining. Just write in the chat. Where are you guys coming from? You have people from all around the world. Let me know, guys, where are you coming from? All right, so slowly, slowly people now will join. Very, very good. Today session gonna focus on the last video I released to the live, uh, to the YouTube channel. It's gonna focus on how to scale your winning products using similar product method, how to make a 10X on your profit in eBay using this method we will practice today. First, I'll answer some questions. If you haven't, all of you watch it. I'll give some examples. And of course, you can also ask me random questions. I'll do my best to answer the questions of all of you. Let me know if you hear me well and you see me well. Smash the like button, comment in the chat right now, your country, where you guys are coming from. EA Music, how you doing? Good to see you, my friend. Good to see you. Slowly, slowly people are joining. Have you watched EA Music? Have you watched the latest video I released to the channel about scaling winning products? Please let me know. How you doing, Noah, Messiah, Karim, Isa, Jose Velez, Boom, West Palm Beach, Florida. How you doing? Great. Good to see you. Booming attitude. I like it already. JMC office is here with us as well. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Guys, if you watched the last video I released to the channel, please write now in the chat the number one. The last video I released to the channel, Jose Ortiz. Como estas from Puerto Rico? Perfect. How many of you try to do it on your own products? On your own store based on what I explained there? Bulungi Nio. Good to see you here, my friend. It's getting a little bit hot here in my room. It's getting hot in here. Karim Aza, no problem. Thank you, my friend. Guys, I'm going to focus today on this method. I'm sure many of you have questions about it. I want to hear your experience using it. I want to know how many of you went through your own stores, look into your winning products and list similar products with tact. Not too many, but in a very accurate way. Where do you come from, guys? Meanwhile, right to the chat. I see Jose Velez from West Palm Beach, Florida. Beautiful. Welcome. 
Where are you rest of you coming from, guys? James C. from Sri Lanka, Kara Maisa from Israel, Bulungi from UK. So I remember all of you guys, you've been here on the last session with me, I remember it. Julio Almanza from California, how you doing Julio? Como estas? Good to see you here. From Tamra, wow, beautiful. Tamra is a great place. Montatico, hey, how you doing? Izudin here is waving. Vazant Patel from India, how you doing? Yeah, music from Morocco. Alan Wasalan. People from all around here with us. Aida Milnarevich from Bosnia, Herzegovina. Vazant from India. We have people from all around the world, guys. Amazing. Okay, so uh, as I said, I will repeat again because new people join all the time. This session is going to focus on the similar product method and how you can use it to scale your own winning products. Literally make a 10x on your own profit. And this is what I did when I started dropshipping back in 2016. I, in the first months, I struggled a lot. After this, I kind of got into the rhythm, listed products but do, doing normal competitor research and after I did it for maybe three four months I came to a point where I feel I'm stuck I, I couldn't I couldn't boost my sales I couldn't boost my profit so I was looking for alternatives while I was doing the, the normal competitor research trying to look for really good selling opportunities you know I don't know if you have this feeling but when you sit to make product research you really hope to find like really good profitable products and you really appreciate every time you find one and I came across a, a seller who was selling smartphones very small mini smartphones and this seller had now mark my word 97 percent feedback score 97 percent feedback score is very bad and I was asking myself what the hell is going on here this seller with 97 percent and uh, selling for very bad performance is selling these smartphones for profit of like 50 percent like 30 40 dollar profit for one i was amazed so i listed i i just kind of undercut him listed one product and it started to sell very good and i was like i felt really lucky and i was like you know what this is a very general title and if this title can sell for this price this product can sell under this side for this price. Let's check out, back in the days I was using Amazon, let's check out on Amazon if there is other products which are similar. And I ran a similar search and I saw like, wow, there are plenty of similar products which are fitting for the world's smallest smartphone. So I took it, I started to list product with the same title, almost same title, and the sales follow. But the main power of this method was that I wasn't anymore I wasn't anymore uh, need to fit my price to other competitors we work with low profit margin. I could find a very cheap product, but fit the price for my winning product, which I was scaling. So I was working on a very high market caps. I had niches. I, I conquer a few niches. One of the first niches I conquer was the small, world's smallest smart smartphones. I worked there with 50% profit margin. Then I worked uh, I, I conquer another niche with the same method. It was a solar security motion sensor lights. All these sensor lights where you put in, in, in the outdoor, outside in the garden, and people walk and it's turning on automatically or by dusk and down, etc. So I start to list also a lot of profit there, and there I work on average profit of $5. $5 average profit. I was selling products between $20 to $50, and everything, all this group of products, the average product was $5, which was amazing. And this is how I scale my profit from $500 a month doing normal competitor research to $5,000 a month, scaling my winning products, growing into categories, but consistently doing it. I came to 1,200 active listings and I generate $5,000 in profit because of this method. So competitor research alone is not enough. If you want to be an extraordinary seller and to do this, high level of profit margins you need to think out of the box you need to do something different 
you need to bring value to the event. All right, so it was my story on how I figured out how I discovered a similar product method. I have here Vazen Patel from India, and Muhammad Arif from Pakistan, Skipper, how you doing? Uliaman say, I'm good, I'm actually on Zik at the moment. Aver que vende la gente. I don't understand what it is. It's France, my friend? France or Spanish, sorry. Taufik. How are you doing from Paris? Nice. Great to see you, my friend. Vazen Patel, I find our, our Ayurveda products stockist in the USA. Very good. You can sell them on eBay, definitely. Aaron with Zombie. Can Zeek Analytics detect Vero on eBay? Absolutely, yes. You need to install the Chrome extension. Okay? Noah Masaya with another question. Nahar, my product is delayed by four days and the buyer left a negative feedback. I offered him full refund and the product when it's arrived, but he doesn't replay my message. What can I do? You call to eBay and you tell them, listen, you tell them, hi, I would like to contact you regarding a very important matter. I received a negative feedback, which affect my seller performance a lot. This is my home business. This is my family business. I, I make my living out of this money. It's really important for me. And after reading, after reading eBay, uh, eBay feedback policies, I see that it's mentioned that if a feedback, if, if a delaying product or a, feed, a negative feedback received caused by, and listen carefully, caused by natural disaster, such as storm, pandemic, whatever it is, eBay have to remove my feedback and then blame the situation, tell them that this happens because of the slow, the delay in sales happens because of the new lockdowns in the in Europe and whatever, you know, find your story around it to make it sound uh, eligible. And I believe 99%, if you call one time, two times, three times, five times, eventually they will remove the feedback. Let's move on with some more product, more questions. I hope I help you know Messiah. Will you be able to share your supplier from whom you source smallest smartphones? It was Amazon, 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 Amazon. Biku Mahat, anyone from Nepal? Uh, I'm sure you will find some people from Nepal. Very beautiful place, by the way. Jose Ortiz, I use Amazon and then one more time ago, I want to restart again from scratch. Do you recommend to use Amazon, Walmart, AliExpress, CG dropshipping? I personally would go more to the AliExpress CG dropshipping direction. Easier to comply with eBay policies. But it's open, it's open. Aaron with zombie, what is a non-API? Good question. A non-API basically is um, it's a um, software which is not connected to API, which is doing all the work as a robot, like scraping outside, okay? Outside eBay API. So eBay can't know if you connect, if you use a software. For eBay, you are working manually. There are different things software is non API software does, like file exchange, which is already a little bit different. All right, guys, what we're going to do right now, I'm going to go into the share screen. We're going to look into the video. I will give you some space for questioning and we're going to do some training about this topic. Okay, I really want to, to give you, you know, another another chance to to practice it in live and see examples so let me here of course fix my screen with the zeke analytics and with with youtube so i'm going to find this video right now one second guys i think i need to put my glasses today i don't see when one second. All right, guys, are you ready? Let's share the screen right now. In today's video, I'm going to review a secret eBay dropshipping hack. All right, let me fix it for you. Oh my God, what a picture of mine. 
Okay, so we are inside here and this is the video, the secret eBay dropshipping hack for more profits, similar product method. A very powerful video, very su highly suggested by the way, to use. Okay, so we have here uh, the introduction, then we talk about the whole process. So we explain about eBay dropshipping hack and uh, give some examples here. If you want me to go through it again, please just say it in the chat. Let me... One second. All right, so here it is. So if you want me to go through this through this um, video, I, I highly, through this PowerPoint, sorry, I really recommend to go through it actually. Let me, let me see if I can open it. So let me open, let me go to the downloads and see where was the last time I have this PowerPoint. I think let's go through it just to understand. It's really important to understand this. Let me just get it ready. Okay, so I will open the PowerPoint here and we're going to go through the example. It's really helpful. It's really important to understand the logic. The logic behind it, it's everything. Okay, it's everything, the logic behind it. So, first of all, I want you to understand how eBay works. This is the eBay search result, okay? And what you want to do, you want to cover as many more space on the first page of eBay where there is high traffic, high relevant traffic. And when we just starting from scratch, we're following competitors, we're doing by ourselves, we kind of, we kind of like, like, you know, we're doing the analysis, gives us high predicted, high, like a very good chance, it's a good prediction, but it's not 100%. Once we do it on our own products, the chances to succeed are much higher, okay? It's very important to understand. So if we know already one product here, this one, a Genian Premium Leather Smart Case was ranked on page one, we want to have everything, all, we want to cover more, more listings on this page because we know the traffic on this page under the iPad cover case will generate traffic. Okay, this is eBay service also. The more we will cover here, the better, the more sell we will get. And we already have the proven result, the listings that already generate sales. So we want to make sure we cover as much as we want. And basically, let's, let's, look, let's move forward. So if I sell this one and I see this is the, on my supplier, I will list it similarly and I will slowly, slowly cover more and more and more space on page one. This is your goal, okay? I show a great example in the video. I show a great example in the video, okay? Here, on this seller, if you remember, it's on the part two live example for scaling your winning products. I found another, I found a seller. Let's open up this seller. I'm gonna open up this seller. We actually do this method and he, he based his store on this method. Let's take a look. So the method here that he's doing, he's, uh, the, the way he's generating this amount of sales dropshipping with AliExpress means he's doing around $1,500 profit with four expenses with this account, is that he's scaling his winning product. And I want to show you how many products he scaled. So he covered a lot of products, the watches, and then we have some jewelries here that he's covered a lot. And you will see uh, different jewelries and he's doing the Spanish titles as well. So he's also using a Spanish title method here. Very powerful method. I think next video I'm going to do is going to be about Spanish titles. And he's selling cremes in Spanish and these bracelets. Look how he's doing beautifully a similar product method, not with only one product, with few products. This bracelet here, this bracelet here, it's all similar type of bracelet more watches, more things for the skin and cosmetics, more watches, more creams. Basically, you have three niches, watches, bracelets, and creams which dominate his store, okay? 
more bracelets, some hats you're also doing, and etc. So what we want to do, we want to do the same things. We want to find ourselves growing to niches. So we have, we have to combine it to do different sides. One side will be to drive traffic. So we, we to drive traffic to new products. So we go, we, we, you know, we're doing competitor research analysis. We bring new product, maybe niche research, we bring new product to the store. We'll give these products time. Maybe a week, maybe a month, depends. Once they perform very well, like product it's sold like four, five, six, seven, ten, ten times, twenty times, we check the product, we check the niche, we go and bring similar products to the niche, and it's going to look like a tree. Let's take a look. So it's going to look like a tree. So you have one product. Let's say, let's say you have right now. Let's say you have right now four products in your store. Okay which are winning. You just got started, you have four or five winning products. Okay? Out of these five winning products or four winning products, let's do five. No, let's leave it four. Okay? Out of these four winning products, you have maybe three products which you can use the similar product method. Some products you cannot do it. Some products are very branded products, you cannot do it. So what, you, what will happen from here, you will start to have branches, to have more branches, another product, and another, this product is successfully walking out, you list another product, successfully walking out, you list another product, etc. Once you dominate the first page of eBay with your listings, then you can continue and do it on a weekly basis. So every week you add one new product to your niche and think about it. If this product generates you 10 sales and 10,000 impressions, page views, sorry, means out of 10,000 page views, you only take 10 sales, you can utilize it in more listings all the time. Okay? So what you will do, you will list more and more products all the time. And sometimes you will also list a new product that works very well. And you get another branch out of this product and go and, and list similar product from the new one that you listed. And what will happen if you have 10 sales and here you have three sales, seven sales, seven sales, two sales, you will start to have a very consistent sales from a lot of products. And you will guarantee profit. You will guarantee profit. This is the most important. And we see it, it's happening everywhere. And everywhere, and slowly, slowly, you have more and more niches, and it's not only one niche anymore, it's five niches and ten niches, and boom, you become a dominant dropshipper who dominate different search results and make money, okay? And this is how we took these four listings that, let's say, give you, in total, we have 10, 15, 20, and 5, okay? So we're talking about... 40, 50 products in total, 50 sales in, in total. Okay, 50 sold in total. And now all this in total, because you're gonna have a lot of listings, not only four. Let's say you have 10 from each niche. So we are talking here about 10 from each niche, it's 40 listings. Okay, this is it's 50 sales from only four listings. So now if you have four, from only four listings, so I have to have 40 listings, and these 40 listings will generate in average two sales. We're talking about another 80 sales. And these 80 sales, because you've been doing this method and working with high profit margin, will give you an average profit of, let's say, $5. Depends on the niche, but $5 is decent for this type of uh, list. So boom, you have only from these 80 sales. Let's do the calculation. Okay, 80 times five, we're talking about another $400 profit. And you grow and you grow and you grow and you grow your listings and you and, and when you will come, let's say to 1,000 listings like this, okay, that out of the 1,000 listings, 500, half, 500 are from this method. And out of the 500, you sell, let's say 500 sales. And out of the other 500, you sell 200, so you get in total 200, you get in total 700 sales. Okay? And your average profit is high, let's say if we combine 
similar product method and competitor research sure the average would be four dollar it's all about averages guys we're talking here about profit let's take a look we're talking about 700 times four it's two thousand eight hundred dollar profit and you've been guaranteeing it this is why i show you the numbers it's not just randomly listing products you're guaranteeing your result this is how you should see things you should see the mathematical the numbers behind it the mathematical approach behind it one winning product leading to another winning product leading to another winning product the profit margins are higher when i work with this method i list more products i sell more i make more profit in general it's super super important now let's analyze the other niche we've been analyzing last time the watches let's analyze this this type of products it's it's spanish so i don't understand a word it's pulseras para hombre mujer unisex fina de mode esclave brazalete men de cuero i hope i was reading good spanish but this probably means some bracelet okay so so what i want to do i want to understand what the keywords that repeating here so i will look on other listings who's selling similar things let's take a look on these listings so we have again pulsera it's probably these things para hombre pulsera para hombre let's see what we search when what happened when we search for pulsera para hombre i'll take this keyword Pulsera para hombre. I'll open the product research. Let's go for all location. And let's see what the results we get for pulseras, pulsera para hombre. Now, I don't speak Spanish, as you can see, but I already recognize the pattern. This is what you need to look for the pattern between the listings. So you have this pattern here, you have more listings. This pulsera hombre here. This pulsera parejes para hombre also. This one here, no pulsera. So we're getting a niche. Take a look at very interesting results. A very, very interesting results. It's it's a, a 100 active listings, 40% success rate, $16 average selling price. He's selling this for 11. You can already see the why he's selling. Average $16. He's selling for $11.99 here, $9.99 here. A very competitive price. Okay, so when we see this, let's go back here for a second. No, here. When see when we see this, and we see okay, guys are selling these products, and they're all drop shippers, by the way. They're drop shippers, drop shippers, drop shippers. This is our friend. Look how our, look how our friend is dominating here with one, two, three, four listings on page one, five listings on page one. You understand? Do you understand the power of my method? I wanted to see what you guys are, are, are writing, what you guys are thinking about it, write in the chat right now. If you're thinking it's amazing, just write boom. If you've been using this method recently after you watch the video, please let me know. I want to know if you start watching. Don't be lazy. Do it with your winning products, guys. Yeah, Satar, make here, this seller here, make here such a good profit margins, okay? His total, look, his 11 sales. Seven says 18 sales already. Another five sales. We're talking about 23 sales. Another three sales, 26 sales. Another three sales, 29 sales, 31 sales. Let's see if you have more. 31 sales. Now let's check out the profit in average. Let's try to find the profit in average, okay? So I search for these products just to see profit in average. So let's check it out. One second, we got something stuck here. Let me see what's happening here. Maybe we have some little ugly right now, taking it out. Ah, it's telling me to put the, the, the break here. Okay, so let's try to find this product in AliExpress. Ah, because I'm on the English, it's not going to find. Let's try to go here. 
to the Spanish Espanol. I'll cut it, I'll surely cut it. Let's find the products he sell. We can also try to search by image. Let's check out where is what is this product. So this product was here, the pulsera. So it's one like this with a crown. All right, it's one with a crown. Let's check it out. One second, Bar Cohen. I will answer your question in a second, okay? Let's just finish this example here. You know what? I will see how to search it in English. It's 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 hard for me to find it in. Uh... One second, guys. Somehow there is some confusion here with my my. Uh... With my language, it's searching in Portuguese. I'm not sure what's going on. I got a little bit confused here. Let's get back here. Let's try to find another bracelet. I just want to give you the average profit that this guy is doing from this. All right, here it is. Good, 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 good. All right, this is the same one. Yeah, nine ninety nine. Let's check out on eBay on the AliExpress the full price. Ah, here you have many different ones. We need the Superman one. So it's two dollar and eighty one cent. Wow, 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 wow. Let's see the shipping. Free shipping. Two dollar eighty one cent. Free shipping, guys. Take a look. Take a look, how many profit you make by one? How many profit? So, 9.99 minus 40% PayPal eBay fees, minus 30%, 30 cents PayPal fees. No, 9.99 minus 40% PayPal and eBay fees, minus 30 cents. 8 minus 281, correct me if I'm wrong, 281. $5 profit on product he sell for $10, guys. It's over 50% profit. I don't know what you think about it, but I think it's amazing, okay? This is an amazing product. It's an amazing profit. It's an amazing niche. Now, he make this $5 profit, and I guess profit is almost similar to all of them. And this is the beauty with this method, because you have one Titan who he's already winning. So you can put any product under it. Doesn't matter how much you buy, even if you buy it for 50 cents, as long as it looks same, you can sell it for any price, for the similar price. So think about it. Let's go back again, calculate his profit only from this product. He's covering here page one with, take a look guys. So we're talking about 11 products plus seven products plus five products plus Three products, it's all same seller. Another three product, another three product, 32, and that's it. 32 product. Now, time, time, $5, right? The average was, what we found was 5.4. He's making $172 profit per month only from this niche. 
only from this niche. That's all. Very profitable also because the cost of the shipping compared to profit is very low. So we're talking about $170 guaranteed from this niche and also very strong because you always list new products with the niche. So you always dominate it. You, you guarantee a long-term profit when you always maintain the niche with new listings. Guys, this is clear for you? Yochai Strasberg, if you take the first case product in orange and duplicate it for all your stores in coloration, you double the profit customers and of course exposure in the amount of your store. It's about the other product case for iPhone. Which product are you talking about, my friend? Let me let me see. But it's the one example. It's definitely an example. I agree with you. I agree with you. Balcoin asked me, what do you think about military products? What I think about it, I think military products are are products which are on the on the limit some of them you can sell so bags just bags you know uh, uh, gloves you can sell anything that is connected to your weapon you cannot sell handles for the weapons all this you cannot sell you have to know this thing right let's get back to the camera guys let me get back to the camera for a second and um, uh, because i want to see what you guys have to say i hope you guys learned a lot from this demonstration i wanted to repeat it again because it's really powerful uh, to understand how to do this kind of things correctly okay it's very 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 important first of all i want to know from you how many of you used this method recently uh, uh, lately in your store right in the chat right now okay Balco and you are right, it really depends on the category and if you are a US seller yourself. Uh, Karam Aisa, where is your question? I can't see your question. Can you please ask it again? You can ask me questions. Ask me. Please, please ask me. I will answer your questions. Julio say Walmart offers free shipping on, one, on any item. I wonder if we can sign up and use it to any location. Worldwide? No, only in the US. Jack Tech say I use Amazon. This method works perfectly for Amazon dropshipping. Navid question, how you set up shipping in eBay because some AliExpress source offering some countries with free shipping and some without. So I need to see each country. So there are countries you need to uh, completely, completely avoid if you're not if you're not becoming an expert in this country. So usually it's Australia, which they ask for extra pro, extra uh, price. You need to, to make sure you can do it, okay? So you are profitable enough. Sometimes it's okay to pay for a little bit of shipping if you're still profitable because you still want to generate those sales. But some countries you need to avoid. So Africa you avoid, South America, there are some countries you want to avoid you. And, and if there was one time mistake you learn and you add this country to the, to the excluded list in your shipping policies, all right? You, you can't guess all in one. You need to avoid the majority and from time to time you will have problems. It's all right. This is the business is to solve the problems, okay? Balcon, if I'm an Israeli seller, can I sell with US policy only sells to US countries? Bal, you will need to contact eBay for that. I, I don't have the answer for you to this level of details. You need to contact eBay for that. He just say, can you do Amazon to eBay researching on the next session, guys? On the next session. Guys, please, if you find this session valuable, where over 50 people watching, 20 likes, please smash the like button. It will really help us. I will truly appreciate it. Okay? And... Remember to share this session, to share this channel with anyone you know. We're releasing a lot of valuable information here, helping a lot of people, okay? Perfect, guys. This wasn't the longest session I had, 40 minute session, 39, almost 40 minute session. I wanna thank you very much for your time. I hope I was able to deliver you some value today. I did my best to, to go through the, the last video and to help you understand it more, answer your questions. I see some more questions coming, so I will answer them as well. EA Music, how to avoid Vera? You can be careful, use tools, but you cannot avoid 100%. But monitors, listers, and also Zeek Booster can help you avoid. 
Kenny Bud Budawa, boom, all right. John Makeup. Hey, I have a question, please. I bought product on AliExpress and the bank charged me 0 0.34 for the non-sterling exchange fee. How can I avoid this fee? You need to make sure that all you work, all your cash flows is optimized for currency as well, okay? So we have to make sure when you buy it on AliExpress, you buy it through the UK, through the UK version where you pay pounds. So AliExpress do the conversions, right? Not from the US, not in dollars. Another questions here coming. What tools you advise me to use? Hey, thanks. What do you mean? Ah, for for uh, various, the, all the tools are almost similar in this, so you don't have to worry. All the listers repricers. Guys, thank you so much. The lister questions, I'll keep it for later. Generally, uh, all the tools are good. AutoDS is also a good tool. Yes. They're all great. Do your own homework, your own research. And if you want a, a list of recommended tools by Zeke Analytics, send a message to the live chat support. Guys, thank you so much. I wish you best of luck. I hope you find this session valuable. We're going to see each other next week on Thursday. Stay tuned for the next upcoming videos. Next, uh, ne this, this, Right, this Friday, we have a video about CJ dropshipping and how to use it and why it's important and good for us. Next week, I'm going to make a video about product research and we're going to have also another video of Ella about the Valentine, best product to sell in Valentine. Smash the like button, ring the notification bell to get notified and subscribe. Thank you very much, guys. Have a beautiful day and I'll see you next time. Ciao.